Though most of us know quitting smoking is critical for lung health, the other things that we don't know about lung cancer can rob us of years to come, and there's also that quality of life thing that can disappear when this disease takes over. So Dr. Bibis Reddy from the Center for Cancer and Blood Disorders is here to talk about this disease and also some new treatment options. Hi, Thanks for having me, Ellie. Absolutely. Merry Christmas, to Merry Christmas to you. Boy, treating cancer is almost easier than making jewelry. <laughs> <laughs> I know. That looked very complicated. But didn't lung it? cancer is a devastating disease. We diagnose about 225,000 patients a year. Wow. Um, about 160,000 pass away from the disease. So it's a very fatal disease. Wow. Well, so tell me about the importance of early diagnosis yeah. and treatment. Well, the most important thing is prevention, stopping yeah. smoking. And if patients have problems, going to visit their doctor. Things like an x ray pick up cancer earlier, things like a CAT scan, but mainly symptoms and talking with your doctor. Okay, so having a, a yearly physical and all those things really kind of come <laughs> into play and yeah. just taking good care of your, your health overall. Exactly. In general. Okay. Uh, well, so tell me, um, what are some of the treatment options that are available if you do find out that this is something that you have? Sure, that's why early detection is important. If you're diagnosed early, you can be treated with surgery or maybe radiation be cured of your disease. Mm -hmm. If your disease is more advanced, so chemotherapy is your only real option and we can't take it all away. Okay, yeah. so there are options. There are options and uh, there's, you just have to talk with your doctor. and. Explore well, all those. And so there's a new type of treatment, and I'm probably going to get the name of this totally incorrect. There are fancy names nowadays. Abraxane? Abraxa Abraxa okay. Abraxane is a new formulation on an old drug we had called Taxol. Mm -hmm. Taxol was a good drug. We learned how to use it, but it had side effects. You had to take steroids before the treatment. There's a possibility of an infusion reaction. So we're always trying to better the treatments we have and improve the responses. Um, Abraxane did that. It increased our response rate by 8% uh -huh. just on the one drug alone. You don't have to take steroids before it. It's a shorter infusion time, and patients just seem to tolerate it better. Oh, well, that's good. Yeah. That's nice to know that new things are being developed all exactly. the time to help with the treatment. Well, so what, what kind of things have you seen, you know, in your own practice, how this has affected people's lives and how you've been able to help them sort of sure. overcome the disease? We've, been, we've had a lot of experience with Abraxane and breast cancer, mm -hmm. and the patients who had it for breast cancer um, did very well with it in general. Of course, every chemotherapy has possible side effects, right. but now we're excited to expand it to lung cancer and try to give those decreased side effects and increased benefits to patients. Well, good. Yeah. Now, what do you say about secondhand smoke? Because for those of us yeah. that aren't smokers, I mean, we are still subject to it and things are getting better as far exactly. as, you know, where people are able to smoke. Now with the new rules and, you know, changing the smoking rules in different institutions like restaurants and bars and things, mm -hmm. I think that's decreasing the exposure. But it's always important. If a family member smokes, the first thing is to try to get them to quit. If they are going to smoke, maybe ask them to take it outside, especially to children. We don't want to expose them. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, good. Well, this is very helpful to know that there are treatments out there, and then just to remind people that early yes. detection is always, you know, the, That's the key. key. And, yeah. and keeping your annual checkups, getting your mammograms, getting your colonoscopies. I'd prefer not to have to see patients, and the best way is prevention. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much, oh, Dr. No, Reddy. We really appreciate it. it. Have Merry a great Christmas holiday. and Happy New Year to Merry you. Merry Christmas to you, too.